there, Sagittarius. It's your girl, Lightwork Goddess and Tarot. If it's your first time coming to my channel, then thank you so much for checking me out. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. So today we're going to be doing your August love reading. We're going to be looking into what's going on with the person on your mind, what is your person's current feelings, as well as their intentions and actions, if any, in the month of August. So I want you guys to focus on this beautiful red root chakra incense and the root chakra is basically the balance of your whole alignment it really has a lot to do with self-esteem value worth and confidence so maybe that resonates for somebody um spirit is saying to somebody be confident and know that you are lovable uh so let's just take that let's take that to cleanse the energy and we're going to jump in to your reading All right, so we're first going to pull tarot, then we're going to go ahead and do some oracles, uh, and then we're going to get some direct message and advice from spirit for my beautiful Sagittarius. All right, Father God, the most high, ancestors, ancient spiritual guides, angels, and all beings of white light, please come into this reading for the beautiful Sagittarius for the month of August. Please let this reading be a vessel of love, light, and blessings, and keep out all demonic energy, negativity, dark magic, evil forces, as is not welcome in my spirit, my house, my energy, my channel, or the collective's heart headspace root chakra overall energy and being and so it is as it be amen all right y'all so let's see sagittarius what's going on with your person because you know what i'm against the same storyline today i want something good i want something lovable but you know what i feel like the energy is just this is collective energy so a lot of energies are very similar of people wanting to return third parties and you know what sagittarius or just in general when people do you wrong they are really focusing on your energy so much that that is why it comes out in a reading because they are really just thinking about what they did and how bad they want to come back into your life but let's hope we get something better okay two of cups through your pentacles spirit said uh -huh. so somebody sees you as a two of cups they see you as their lover they want to build a foundation with you with this three of pentacles but let's keep going what's the current feelings for sagittarius this person in the month of august 2021 What's the current feelings? What are they feeling about them at this very moment? If you're a cross watcher and your person is a Sag, this will be their feelings, intentions, and possible actions. Current feelings, spirit. Oh, you see how that flew out? Oh, somebody shoots you as the star. Oh, but they felt like you walked away or they walked away. Okay. Back of the deck. Five of Pentacles. Somebody feels left out in the cold, Sagittarius. Um, so what I'm getting, let me just make sure that the cards you could see them all. Let's just make sure. We have so with the two of Two of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. Somebody wants to see you as their lover. They want to build on a solid foundation with you. Um, they see you as the star, abundant, beautiful, popular, gorgeous, glamorous. Um, just everything that someone could be a star, someone who shines, um, someone very talented, someone very charismatic. But we have the Eight of Cups. So this person walked away from you. They walked away from their star or you walked away from them. Because I feel like with temperance, they were taking too long to make a decision about you. This could have been somebody that you were dating. Somebody that you weren't fully committed to. They With the Two of Pentacles, they could have been juggling you with somebody else. You with just other situations, other um, obligations. But it was taking too long which for you, my Sagittarius. With temperance, they were taking too long juggling you. But now this person is sees you as the ten of cups they want to be with you they want a fresh start they see you as their wish fulfillment they feel left out the left out in the cold with the five of pentacles they feel like they can have the house kids and dog with you all right so let's get their intention you know i'm just getting like slow feet cold feet I feel like this was somebody that maybe you was moving very slow and patiently with. And ultimately, you pulled back your energy. You walked away. It a cups. You felt back. And now, they see that they were just juggling you for too long. And they want this ten of cups with you. So, what's their intention, spirit, when it comes to love for Sagittarius for August? Ooh, Ace of Cups. They want to give you their love. 
Oh, they want to come towards you with the eight of raw spirit said, don't pull nothing out. We got the queen of wands in the back of the deck. This person's coming towards you quick, hastily, quick communication, quick movement. I feel like this person with the queen of wands is somebody who's confident, who knows what they want, who knows what they're doing, who makes decisions swiftly and quickly. This person wants to come towards you. They want to move towards you quickly and give you this love offer. I'm here and I can't let my baby go. Oh, Sagittarius. I was like, please, God, let me get some good energy for somebody. All right. So what's their action? That's their intentions. But are they going to do it? Let's see what the action. Don't let me down now. Oh, five of pentacles. They really feeling left out in the cold. Clarify that five of pentacles for the action spirit. Justice. Okay. Okay. So, although this person has a lot of love for you, they feel left out in the cold with the five of pentacles. They want to move towards calmer waters with you. So there is some sort of action. I definitely feel like they're going to bring in some communication in the month of August. Um, however, I feel like this person is a little bit hesitant because they know they need to bring you some sort of justice with the moon being here. It's like this person is feels left out in the cold is kind of maybe very a little bit nervous to come towards you even though i do see them moving towards you quickly um but ultimately they still have a lot of secrets or i feel like when they come towards you they are going to give you some sort of justice about what was going on what was taking them so long to make a decision about you my beautiful sagittarius my nail just popped off and i feel like i lost it in my hair what the what the hell is it still in my hair I just lost my damn nail, but we're going to keep going. So, yeah, I feel like this person is definitely going to come towards you and give you some type of justice about the secrets that they were keeping for you because they want to move towards common waters. Oh, look at the lovers. <laughs> Yo, let me just clarify this moon card here. I'm sorry, y'all. I lost my nail. I feel like it's in my hair. I have really big curly hair and... I just don't know where that shit is. All right. Let's get the moon card for you. Hanged man. Yep. Hanged man. This person is like kind of in their head about how much they should tell you, what they should tell you, what they shouldn't tell you. But ultimately, they're going to give you this justice because look. They're King of Cups and they're Page of Swords. They're watching you. Queen of Cups, divine counterparts. It's a burden not having you in their life. They're willing to fight obstacles to come towards you and be decisive about this because you are their wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups. It's a read. <laughs> it's a reading. Yes, this person is watching you. They are sick of being left out in the cold. They popped my nail off. They said, listen, I'm coming for my, my Sagittarius. Okay, Spirit said that's what it is. All right, your baby's coming back to get you like chilies. You are their wish fulfillment fulfillment yup all right let's drop some oracles on this b i'm happy y'all just gave me mad energy y'all that just gave me mad good energy y'all because i've been like kind of down in the dumps and it's like when you're when you're reading you're picking up mad energies it's like sad when you keep hearing about third parties bullshit and shit like that i want people to work this shit the fuck out yo i want them to work it out yo we don't want no separations you're very close to achieving a goal a personal issues reaches conclusion. Full moon in Cancer. Your person could be a Cancer. What else, Spirit? Give me a few more cards for what's going on with Sagittarius person. This wants to come out. A win-win outcome is forecast. Full moon and Libra. That's coming up soon. Libra season. Libra season's coming. Okay. Someone could be a Libra, but Libra is also the sign of justice. So, like I said, I feel like this person about to come to you, Sagittarius, and tell you everything. Like, they're going to keep it 100 with you, is what I just heard. Because they love you. We have work through your fears and do not let your past hold you back in reverse. And then we have balance of practicality and spirituality. So, I feel like in the past... 
Or I feel like what that means, Spirit is saying that this person is working through their fears and they're not letting the past hold them back. They're not letting the things that they did in the, that's full moon, that's new moon in Scorpio. So we have Libra and Scorpio. So you know what? Those are some signs that could be prevalent here or something can have off, pop off in those seasons. Take it how it resonates. But I feel like in the past, this person was letting fears hold them back, but now they're trying to work through it. And they don't want to let the things that's happened between you two, um, you know, create any more issues in the connection. Yeah, because they're looking forward to uh, working it out with you. They want their baby back. Talk about chilies. This person knew that they took too long to make a decision with you. But uh, they being decisive now. They said they know what they want. They said, I made a decision. They balancing out their practicality and spirituality. This person might have had some sort of spiritual awakening. Become a clear channel. I feel like they've gotten a clear message. They've gotten clarity. They now want to be of service and they're willing to make the necessary sacrifices. I know that's right. Yes. Let's just drop some cute little love messages for you. Yeah, they're ready. This is somebody who's ready. Now, I don't know if you want them back, Sagittarius, but I'm getting a good energy. Whoever this resonates is somebody who's very ready because they're ready to make the effort. They have released their ex. If they was dealing with somebody, they released an ex. Okay. They released that ex. And they're ready to make the effort right now. And I see like young, playful children energy. We have wedding in reverse. If this person was married, they released that motherfucker. Mm, take it how it resonates. Won't be for everybody. Because there was a separation here. And there was no romantic feelings wherever they was at in reverse. Mm-hmm. Wedding reverse. Like, yeah, this person let somebody go. They might have been juggling you with somebody else, but now they realize that you're the person they want, Sagittarius. One more card spare for my Sag. Codependency. They released the codependency, healed family issues. Listen, in reverse, this person might have done a whole 360 and is really trying to change their play your ways. I'm here and trying to get out of being a an F boy. Let me get some direct messages. They better tell me the right things at this point because I feel like, you know, what else, spirit? Ooh. What else, Spirit? Mm. All those flips, those flips, those flips, those flips, those flips. All right. Woo! Oh, gosh. All right, back of the deck, rich, wealthy, boss. So you could be rich, wealthy, or this person could be a boss. Uh, take it how it resonates. Okay. All right. All right. So this person feels like y'all have bomb sex. They definitely feel very sexually connected to you. This person wants to get drunk, have a few drinks, go out with you, drunk in love. I feel like maybe y'all used to link up, have drinks, and just enjoy each other's company. Um, Aquarius is here. So you or your person could be an Aquarius. Um, they're praying about y'all. Yeah, this person may in the past have been somebody who was not balanced spiritually. But this this is, I'm seeing a grown man on their knees. Like, I need my Sagittarius back. Um, this person could have kids. So we did have wedding in reverse. I feel like this person could have been in a marriage of some sort. Take it how it resonates. It could have been very codependent, very toxic, and it could have been why you, that you were being juggled. And children could have just been an issue. Um, but this person is happy now. They're saying, I'm happy now that they released this ex and they're ready to come towards you, Sagittarius. They are a stalker. They are watching your social media. They want you back like cooked carat. Um, They learned a karmic lesson. This person learned a valuable lesson about how to treat people. About I feel like you were very genuine, very loving, very open in this person has learned this karmic lesson this cycle has somewhat closed for them and they're, they they want to come towards you 
and they about to tell their wife they husband whoever they partner i choose them and i'm out sneaky link in reverse you are no longer a sneaky link i'm sorry sad but you may have been a sad you you may have been a a, a a side chick or a side guy this person has sneaky link in reverse they do not want to be sneaky with you no more they want to make it official we have pisces here in reverse so somebody here could be a pisces i watch your social media in reverse so this person definitely stalks you but they don't want you to know but once again sexy times they want you to sit on it <clears throat> I haven't changed. So this person, um, I haven't changed this here. So there can still be a few little things that this person has to work through before they can come towards you. So just be mindful of that. But you guys definitely have some type of soul tie. Um, the per Your person could have been very negative in the past, but they can be very positive now. They could have previously been around a lot of negative influences. Or I can feel, I feel like this person may have been very negative towards you, but you were very positive, Sagittarius. They want you to know that you're real. What do we have marriage like i said your person could have been married take it how it resonates they want to start over with you they do not want you to go they want you to have their baby they want you to pray for them they feel like a loser without you they feel like you're very faithful loyal you're the best they ever had still paces in reverse that is not moving slow that air coming towards you quickly and swiftly we have i'm sorry in reverse i feel like that's what your person is telling their ex or their spouse or whoever like i'm not sorry i'm coming towards my sag and they know that they lied they know they did you wrong they came they might even be watching tarot readers and psychics look at that uh libra is here we had libra here two times side of justice but something very important might happen during libra season we have stds i mean be mindful of that take it how it resonates you might want to wrap it up maybe a person has an std maybe in the past they gave you an std maybe someone gave them an std we had karmic lesson here we don't know we don't know we have hours oh that either means they want to give it to you in a few hours or you might hear from this person in a few hours somebody might i don't know fake friends so yeah we had negative influence i feel like this person may have been around a lot of fake people who are infl who are influencing them to um do you wrong or not take you seriously or just be a player and have multiple third parties but ultimately ultimately they need you and they feel like you are their soul mate in the name listen i am so happy with this energy sagittarius that is the vibe somebody loves you and they are coming back to towards you to be serious they have released some sort of ex they have gotten out of some sort of marriage you know it's not gonna be for everybody but this person is not playing no games this person about to apply pressure i'm hearing on you and they about to move quickly with you because you are their wish fulfillment so that's all i got for you sagittarius what a beautiful reading for the month of august 2021 be sure to like comment share and subscribe and remember to always love yourself first but wait i forgot to get you guys one little some call some advice cards let me get you one advice from spirit card all right. What's the advice for Sagittarius? Woo! That's a lot. What's the like, advice for Sagittarius in the month of August? In general, anything they need to know, Spirit? Give me a card. Ooh. Everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your ass up and handle it. You are going through some tough shit. So whatever you're going through, if you're going through something just in your personal life, Spirit is just saying this is not going to last forever. If you're in pain or very sad about this separation with your person or whatever happened with this person, Spirit is saying, you know, everyone has their time when they go through issues. Everybody goes through some sort of pain. Don't take it personally. Don't feel attacked by God or the universe. Just know that you're going to come out of this and you're going to receive your blessings as long as you remain high vibrational and positive. So that's all I got for you, Sagittarius. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day and be sure to like, comment, share and subscribe. Bye-bye.